look, we got 2023 three and two, Panini three and two baseball. Super cool product. I mean, it's very exciting because I love not a lot of cards, high reward, that sort of thing. It's kind of my deal. So here you got five cards total, hence the three and two, right? Not, not that, not ironic. You got one slabbed, one memorabilia, both slabbed, and then you got three base cards or inserts. So there are some short print inserts to look for uh, in this set. Uh, one of them uh, specifically that uh, they point out uh, is called Spotlight Spikes. So it's going to be one of the uh, rare inserts to look for. And then you got jumbo swatches, really cool things. Now we're talking about legends, hall of famers, and prospects. That's what, that's what we consist in this product. We don't have any current players. All right, so we're gonna dive right in here. See what we got again, five cards. You got two slabs, you know, coming, and then you got three base cards or inserts. So let's take a look. Let's just open it up and see what we got. All right, here's our two encased cards right on top. Let's start here with this nice patch auto. Carson Williams, that's gonna be number 12 out of 12. Very awesome. So this here, this is obviously a prospect. It mentions here that he did really well in 2022 in class A. So we're talking class, we're talking big time prospect for Tampa Bay. That is extremely cool. And you know, you got you see here that says Lone Star. So this is a, the Lone Star auto patch, two-color patch, which is really great. I really like the look of that. Then we here's our second slab. So this has got five swatches on it. Jackson Job, 28 out of 35. Full count swatches, they call this one. Very cool. So we got one batter prospect, one pitching prospect. One, one two color patch out of the five. Very cool. Then you got your pack of your base cards slash, you know, possibly inserts. Uh, let's see. Right off the bat, we have Jacob Miller, 10 out of 50 on the horizon. Jacob Miller, another prospect on the horizon. It's actually one of the, one of the inserts that they point out <laughs> in, in the clippings there online. Then next we got, obviously not a prospect, one of the all time greats. John Smoltz, this is 22 out of 150. So we get our first, and from the looks of it, our only kind of legend of the game. That's the moments insert there. And last but not least, from Milwaukee, we got a rookie here. Jackson Chorio, it's gonna be 79 out of 99 the rookie. So we got basically a box full. We're looking prospects here all across the board, rookies and prospects, which when it comes to baseball, regardless of the product, that's kind of where you live. I mean, that's, I know it's one of the most popular things in some other products. If you want to compare looking for those rookies and prospects, you compare that to like Bowman, who's known for those Bowman firsts. So this kind of lives along those lines. When you start talking about, except you're getting a jump start when you talk about in, already encased auto relic, all combined into one. So when it comes to Panini 3 and 2, you have to remember this is not a licensed product. That's why you don't have any of the logos on there. And that's why they stick now with Legends, Hall of Famers, and also Prospects. They don't have the current plays in there since that licensing doesn't belong to Panini anymore. But it doesn't diminish the fact that this product still offers you a high-end product, a high-end card uh, coming with limited numbers. Also, the, these really awesome relics and you know larger swatches multicolored swatches. So it really covers that gamut. It's very exciting to open up that box. The presentation alone is, is very suspenseful, makes it a lot of fun. So I recommend that product there. And you know, with the fact that it isn't licensed, it does bring that price down just a little bit. So it is only a five card box. So risk reward, you weigh that, whatever you prefer. I also, personally, I do like kind of lesser cards, bigger chance for reward, something that I look for in cards, but all up to you. I think this is a great rip, gives you a ton of fun. Can't wait to see what's in those encased cards. Midwestcards.com does have it. Hey, and along with anything else you're looking at that fits maybe the other needs that I talked about, it's there waiting for you. I'll see you over there.